smells like Christmas trees in here. <laughs> How's it going everybody? My name is Liam. I am so excited today. I'm here in Fundy National Park in New Brunswick, Canada. I'm very far from home right now and I couldn't be happier. I'm doing some hiking here in Fundy, just spending the day here. The family's here as well, but I'm doing a bit of my own hiking because so that I can get the most out of this park. I'm on my first trail right now. We're gonna be doing some amazing hiking here. We're going to see some waterfalls as well as the Bay of Fundy where the water level changes more on a daily basis than anywhere else in the world. And it's a must see for people around the world. today it's perfectly fine this wetland is still beautiful there's one more lookout at the very end of the bog here maybe I can get a different angle and see something but right here can't complain about this view it's amazing here Second lookout point, I think this one's better. Get a beautiful aerial view of this. Wetlands are so sick. I don't feel like people talk about them enough. Like there's such a good place for life, you know? They got a mix of fish, amphibians, reptiles, huge moose, like it's crazy. And I'm almost done this trail and then things are only gonna get better from this nice little wetland. We're gonna be seeing the ocean soon and some amazing waterfalls. I think I'm the most excited about the waterfalls actually because they're pretty sick, pretty sick. So um, let's get moving. Say goodbye to this beautiful piece. Just about to wrap up this trail. One trail down, a couple more to go. I love it here. There's a wetland trail. I wanted to do a trail kind of walking within the forest because most people obviously come here for the coastline. So I wanted to experience the forest here and then I was gonna move on to the things that people actually come here to see, like the waterfalls and the Bay of Fundy. So that's where we're going now. I'm super looking forward to this waterfall, not gonna lie to you. Pretty good. I like that. It just keeps getting better. the most visited waterfall in the park and there's a reason why. Ridiculous. That was definitely a moment right there. That waterfall is one of the best I've ever seen. And as somebody who lives near a lot of waterfalls and is used to seeing them, it still blew my mind. So that's how you know it was that good. I'm gonna be wrapping this trail up. It was just a short kilometer just to see the falls. Then we're seeing what's considered the best part of the park, the Bay of Fundy and the shoreline doesn't get much better than that. What an adventure this is. Got the waterfall over there, a little lookout right here. Not the greatest lookout I've seen in the world, but you can see the falls and they're really going today because New Brunswick has been getting hammered with rain for the last couple days. So it's water everywhere. And there's a reason the waterfalls look so good after the rain. What do you think about it? Beautiful, I love it. Not bad, excellent. Huge stairwell, 
and this is gonna take us down to the beach. I'm so look looking forward to this beach. Low tide right now, so there's a lot of sand out right now. I'm kind of speechless right now. Just walking, I'm making my way down to this water. We're at like really low tide right now. Normally where I'm standing, the water would be up high at night or in the morning. So pretty soon this water will be all covering these rocks again. I don't even know how that's possible. By the way, you can see the mountains in the distance. That is the next province over in Nova Scotia. This place, I mean, I knew what I was expecting. I looked up this place, I did my research but it's not till you really come to the place that you really get to experience it and see how amazing it truly is. So very grateful that I got to come here today to Fundy. Super unique place. I got a Fundy shirt, so I'll be whipping that out in a couple days, I'm sure. It was great. radical place here tons and tons of people as well as tons and tons of mud not a huge fan of that however this place is beautiful and there is a reason that everybody comes here I'm getting soaked with the mud right now it's beautiful that's no good look at this mud What a spot this is. This is outrageous. The way these rocks form here is really unique as well, which I find interesting. All right, round two of another crazy beach. Pretty gnarly here. I gotta wrap things up. We're making our way to Prince Edward Island now, the next province on our East Coast trip. But this is a must see for anybody in the area, for sure. Loved it here, even though I kind of destroyed my shoes. Hopefully I can clean that up soon. I wouldn't be surprised if you guys have seen these before. It's something so iconic that you just kind of see in random photos that you don't even ask to see. So I think that's why I thought it was so cool. Like you get a New Brunswick postcard and you get a picture of this, these rocks, which is really cool. weirdest hotel format I've ever stayed in. I don't know what this is, to be honest. It looks like the back rooms. <laughs> All right, Fundy was amazing. Same with those rocks. It's really eye-opening to see something like that, especially coming from where I come from. That just doesn't exist. So it's always amazing to see something you're not familiar with and you just kind of fall in love with it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed what you saw today. If you liked it, Make sure you subscribe and leave a like because I greatly appreciate it. Don't forget to stay in the great outdoors and until next time in Prince Edward Island, I'll see you all later.